So the age-old question, who wins, DJI Mavic or the Phantom 4? Which one is better? How do we find out? Well, let's break it down really quickly. DJI Mavic flies 30 minutes. Phantom 4 flies 30 minutes. DJI Phantom 4 shoots 4K. DJI Mavic shoots 4K. Mavic is smaller in size. DJI Mavic, small. Phantom 4, big. Why does the size difference matter? Obviously, Phantom 4 is larger. It'll fly better in higher winds. It'll fly better in general in the wind. Has larger motors. Gonna have a higher top speed. DJI Mavic, smaller size. Fits into your bag easier. It's easier to get around, travel with, things like that. The size is a winning factor in that sense that it's easier to transport, it's easier to use. It's easier to get around, it's easier to set up. The props always stay on the drone. You don't take props on and off when you're storing it or you're transporting it. That's one cool feature. Another feature I like about the DJI Mavic is the narrower field of view. So the field of view is gonna be like a 28 millimeter lens on a full frame camera. The Phantom 4 has a wider field of view. So the DJI Mavic, you can get in closer. It looks like you're closer which when you're further away and you kind of get a cool look with that narrow field of view compared to the wider field of view on the Phantom 4. Is it a drawback for the Mavic? Kind of, sort of. So when you're flying, you're gonna get more feedback in the camera with that tighter field of view where with the Phantom 4, you have that wider field of view, so you're gonna have less feedback when you're flying in the wind, stuff like that, having issues. The Mavic also has an issue with tap to focus. You gotta make sure you're constantly tapping focus, at least people were saying. I haven't had that issue, really. I usually just tap on it once or twice, and it's good to go. With the Phantom 4, you have that larger field of view, so it's gonna get focus everything to not have an issue. Let's talk about speed flying overall. The Mavic flies like a fire jet. It goes, I have no, had no issues with you know, wanting to go faster, it flies fast. Normally flying, you know, perfectly fine, flying fast. The Phantom 4 also, tons of speed there. So they both kind of win in that sense. The Phantom 4 is gonna have a higher top speed if you're looking for that top speed. But overall, they both fly great. The Phantom 4 is gonna be a little bit better in the air because it's a larger craft. The cameras themselves, you have the difference in field of view. They both shoot 4K. You're gonna get higher quality images out of the Phantom 4 with the higher megapixels and the video itself is gonna look a little bit better on the Phantom 4, I feel like. a little bit, It's a little bit sharper. I'm not sure if that's just because the, the camera's adding sharpness or not, but looking at the actual quality of the camera and the footage, you can see it looks a little bit sharper on the Phantom 4. So the Mavic Remote, this is our upgraded antennas on there. It's not the normal antennas, but normally this folds up, fits into a bag very simply and easy. It still does with the antennas on it. I really like the size and the function of this controller. It feels like you're really flying like a kind of high-end kind of gaming controller. It just feels good. So you just put your phone in there and you just fly. I like a little screen here, it gives you information, stuff like that. The Phantom 4 remote is gonna be larger, bulkier. You know, just it's just not that cool looking. It's not futuristic. It's not like something that you see coming out of Star Wars. This is just cool. It just pops open like that. It's, yeah, but it's cool, I like it. Is that really something that you're gonna pay more or pay less for? I don't know, it's something that I like. The Phantom 4 is a little bit more expensive than the Mavic. The batteries are going to be a little bit, I think they're about the same price wise. Buying a case for the Mavic is going to be a little cheaper because it's a smaller size. You know, when it comes down to the accessories, you're going to be a little bit more pricier on the Phantom 4 side just because it's a larger drone. Everything's a little bit bigger. They both have sensors in the front. Obviously, the Phantom 4 Pro now has sensors all the way around, but that's a different video in itself. But the Phantom 4 and the Mavic both have sensors in the front sensing objects. So when you're flying forward, you're not going to run to a tree. I tell people, make sure you fly forward always because when you're backing up, you don't have a sensors and people get lost. They end up in a tree or on the side of a building and you lose your drone. One thing I really like about the size also with the DJI Mavic is flying through objects. I'm always just out flying around trees and flying through buildings, stuff like that. You can really get in tight and close with the Mavic. I feel like I'm flying an FPV drone, but not because it's still easy because it's a Mavic, but it has the GPS enabled, all that fun stuff. But you can put it into sport mode and it gets crazy. It really likes to go. You can really get it flying around. Also, the Phantom 4 has sport mode as well if you want to get crazy and fly it around. They both have intelligent flight modes in the app you can use, so they both have that. Is there a clear winner? Probably not. It really comes down to your preference of what you're looking for in a drone. If you're looking for higher quality stills, images, and picture of you know video, the Phantom 4 wins in that sense. If you're looking for a smaller compact drone, the DJI Mavic wins in that sense. So do we have a clear winner? Probably not. We'll give them both a gold star for being awesome. I have both. I fly around the world with my DJI Mavic and the Phantom 4 because it's great to have both easily throw the Mavic up in the air and have the Phantom 4 for getting those photos and videos that I need. If you guys have any questions, leave a comment below. If you want to check out some of the best deals, head on over to dronenerds.com.
for all the best deals on all your favorite DJI products and accessories.